Hi, I'm Malin, and today I want to talk about taking life day by day, getting 1% better each day. We often like to come up with, with these big goals, these big visions that we kind of want to accomplish, you know? And these are very motivating, you know, when we see like these big goals, but then if we're not really taking progress, if we're not really, if we're not really building the habits, if we're not capable of doing it, it can feel very daunting and overwhelming, you know? Like all of these big goals, you know, having a muscular physique, finding a partner that we can spend our life with, um, making enough money, um, finding a career that we find fulfilling. All of these things are kind of nice goals to have and we may set ourselves like goals like, for example, with this YouTube channel to have 10 million subscribers or so many views and that sort of thing. But focusing on these results and outcomes can make us feel really overwhelmed if we're not capable of doing it. And it kind of takes away the focus from the things that we can be doing to all of the things that we're not doing and it creates this expectation and this big gap towards what we want and where we are and it can make us feel really overwhelmed and kind of not great about ourselves, not make us not feel great about ourselves. So what I've been implementing into my life is just taking it day by day and kind of doing my best and just each day trying to get a little bit better because if I do every day the actions that will get me to these results, then I don't really need to worry about the results. I don't need to worry about the outcome. Of course, it's important to reflect and look back, but if I'm just focusing on each day, doing the things that will get me what I want, that will reinforce the identity that I want to reinforce, and if each day I'm just recording these videos, for example, and I'm putting them out there, then that's what's going to get me more views, it's what's going to get me more knowledge and more experience doing these sorts of things and then if I reflect on it and look back on it you know each day and kind of see you know what should I do more and how can I make my videos better that's kind of how we see progress and that's kind of fulfilling you know like we see these problems like for at the moment I've been creating these videos and I realize that when I talk I like look around all the time and I'm not really looking at the camera so with these videos I'm trying to look into the camera more so then we create like this connection and it shows that I'm a bit more confident in myself and it creates, you know, it's just nice to just have someone to look in your eyes when you're speaking to them. And just, you know, finding out all these little problems and then working on them, it kind of creates this satisfaction in your day to day because you're like, oh, you know, I have clarity, like this is kind of what I want to do, this is what I can do and these are my kind of problems that I have at the moment and I'm just trying to fix them and work on them. And I still have like this big goal, you know, kind of of like, or this vision of how I want my life to be and how I want to get there. But all I really know is the next step and all I have control over is my body right now and what I can do now. You know, the future is undeterminable. We can't really, we can manipulate it, but we can only manipulate it in the moment with the actions that we do and the habits that we kind of build. So that's what I've kind of found more beneficial in my life, just to, to live day by day and solve these little problems in your day to day kind of um, moments, you know, like these little kind of things that you can kind of fix each day. You're just trying to get a little bit better and you're just trying to stick to this schedule and follow these habits and build the life that you kind of want to. And I've found this to work a lot better than creating these big goals because then whatever you do, it never feels like it's enough, you know like just creating these videos, it's like, oh my God, I'm such, if I were so worried about getting to 10 million subscribers, you know, for example, and I was just creating these videos, I'd be like, oh my God, my speaking is so bad. I'm not looking at these people right. My content isn't good enough. Nobody's view viewing my content enough. What am I going to do? This is so terrible. And it just creates this big gap and all of this kind of negative thoughts and feelings. Whereas if I'm just focused, all right, what can I do? I can work on my speaking, I can look at the camera more directly, I can reflect on the problems that I've made, what content sticks better, what I enjoy, what the content that I want to make. And each day I can do that and each day I can work on it. And day by day, bit by bit, I get slowly better. And then these things kind of compound until, you know, all of a sudden you're doing a lot more and you're able to reach the goals that you want to. So focus on the actions that will get you to the outcomes that you want rather than on the outcomes themselves. I'm Malin, thank you for watching this video.